I know it's not a report, but it's still there. And it's Dion's best friend, Michael Irvin, who is spreading the Dion to the Cowboys rumors. <laughs> Dion's saying all the right things, you know, because he has to. Look, he's playing. You know, yeah. You got games going on. You got recruits. He's not going to say, hey, I'm all in if the Cowboys call. Plus, Mike McCarthy is still employed there. I, I'll separate fact from fiction with what's going on with this. So... I just think this is the first take fever dream, right? This is this is Stephen <laughs> A. Smith just wish casting the greatest thing that could ever happen to him. Because think about the two topics that guarantee conflict, that guarantee eyeballs, the Cowboys and Deion Sanders. Like it is it is the wet dream of anyone who hosts a sports debate show. And I think that's where this is coming from. I don't think that's going to happen. I, I, If you look at what Dion's doing, he's actually prepping for more of a career at Colorado. I, and, and I had my questions early on, like when Shadur was gone, when Shiloh was gone, when Travis Hunter was gone, would he still want to be there? So they're, they're in the process of flipping a top quarterback recruit from Georgia named Julian Lewis, who was committed to USC. He's probably going to commit to Colorado. Uh, they had Alabama's best offensive line recruit in town for an official visit last week. They're trying to flip him too. Like they are certainly acting like Dion plans to be at Colorado and try to keep winning games in the Big 12. 